how many barrels are still in the Gulf or on its shores in some form? Probably about three fourths would still be uh, roughly, I would say, if we, we uh, to go through the calculations that we have, the uh, the only oil that you would say that's actually removed from the environment would be that 800,000 plus the amount that was burned. The stuff that evaporated into the atmosphere is still in the environment. Uh, the stuff that dissolved into the water column, the, uh, the amount that uh, dispersed into the water column is droplets plus the amount that uh, was on the sheen on the surface or in tar small tar balls. Uh, so in that case, uh, I would say most of that is, is still in the environment. It's not available for response, which was the purpose of the uh, oil budget uh, numbers. You cannot uh, do any recovery operation on oil that's evaporated or is uh, dissolved into the water column. So even according to the calculations of the oil budget, that is the report that was released last week, between 60 and 90 percent of the discharged oil, that is the oil that actually went into the ocean, remains in the Gulf of Mexico, and that would be between 2.45 and 3.675 million barrels. Is that accurate? <laughs> I'd have to do the calculations here on my head. But